Good afternoon. When you're watching this, it'll be Thursday, June 2nd. Uh, this video shall be not really anything other than a Vinegar Syndrome eBay haul video where I uh, paid more than I probably should have for some uh, Vinegar Syndrome leases that I missed out on because I am a sucker that loves that cardboard of the same image that's on the cover of the film, but I need that slipcover because I'm a sucker for it. So, anywho, um, I got some here. I'm going to open up and show you what I got. And uh, that's what this video is going to be about. So let's uh, crack into it, I suppose. So here's number one. And these are all ones that I've been kind of eyeballing for a bit, but I'm just like, you know what? Um, probably should just do it right now because like our gas prices, a lot of these things are just going up and up and up in price. So here's number one, uh, packaged fairly well. Packaged extremely well, because I'm struggling to even get it out. Well, that's actually neat. Uh, this person actually put it in a uh, protective uh, sleeve thing. Um, these are really nice, but I feel like if I got into that, that would be a lot of money I'd be dropping on these things right here. I might put my uh, steel book in there that has all the uh, excerpts that are flopping around, so that might be good to do. But uh, this one I got uh, Dimensions Occultus, which I believe was the Don't Panic film. Yeah, so... I'll even put a little thing in there to avoid it from uh, getting messed up. So uh, let me show you here. <clears throat> it's a nice slip cover. I tell you, the Vinegar Syndrome covers are very, very nice. Now if you're wondering what this film is, uh, it's Don't Panic. It's Michael's 17th birthday and his friends have decided to surprise him with the ultimate birthday bash. Breaking into his house and playing with a Ouija board, which is always a bad sign. Uh, but what they think is just a harmless bit of fun quickly turns into a supernatural terror when they unwittingly summon a demonic presence named Virgil. Uh, who proceeds to possess someone close to Michael, forcing them all to savagely kill anyone and everyone Michael cares about. All the while, Michael begins to have terrifying dreams, which he slowly begins to realize might be visions of carnage, which only he can stop. So that's a little premise of Don't Panic there. Which I've never seen. I've just been wanting to buy it for the longest time. All right, we're just going to cut that. Hmm, you are a hard one to get open. Let's try that route. Eh. Nope. Oh, wait. <laughs> Technology! There's actually a little... Oh, it's taped. All right, well, I almost had it. All right. Here we go. That did a little bit of damage. Well, I'm gonna say these are packed really well. I appreciate it. However, 
Oh, uh, that's that doesn't sound good. Uh, that's why this person was very smart and put something in the spindle area, whereas this person didn't. And I can hear the uh, Blu-ray is loose. Now, this one I wanted to buy for some dumb reason um, because when I first, you know, heard about vinegar syndrome, um, this was actually one of the first things I heard about was the uninvited. Um, so this is it right here. To me, I feel like it's a ship with a nasty cat on it. Um, I'm going to open this up and hope that the uh, film isn't jacked up. Oop. Wow. Well, I'm watching the Blu-ray of it, so it's okay. The DVD is what uh, came loose, I guess. So. And uh, like the Scream Factory releases, I actually like to uh, switch out the artwork. So this is the uh, same artwork you see on the front, and I'm just going to flip it over, and I guess this is probably what the original uh, artwork was back in the day. And then let me uh, tell you about this here little film. So the uh, uninvited at a secluded biochemical lab, which runs cruel tests on animals, a seemingly innocent looking cat has just escaped. That sounds like, uh, again, <laughs> a bad, bad thing that happens when an animal escapes from a laboratory. A lot of films have actually started out like this. Like Man's Best Friend. Good film. I enjoyed that one. Um, but beneath its furry exterior is a terrifying monster. A, ter <laughs> a terrifying monster has been seated, emerging to brutally maim and kill anyone it finds threatening. Discovered by a group of teenage spring breakers and brought aboard a luxury yacht bound for the Cayman Islands, this cuddly little fluffball quickly begins gnawing away at the ship's guests and crew. But to make matters even worse, it soon revealed that the cruise's host, a renowned multimillionaire, is in fact on the run from the law and won't return the boat to shore. The killer mutant cat be damned. Uh-oh, the battery is running low. I will be right back. Dang it. All right, I got a little bit of juice in this camera. I'm gonna wrap this on up and finish up here. Uh, this is the third and final one right here, uh, which I believe this was the one I was most excited about. And uh, it came in an actual box, so I appreciate that. That is, of course, taped very well. You know, one thing I think all of you should applaud is the fact that I've not cut off one of my fingers yet doing all these unboxing video things. Because, uh, you know, there's been a lot of close calls where I've, uh, you know, gotten close to cutting my finger off or slicing something. So, I deserve some kind of award, damn it. Alright, almost open. Jesus Christ. Alright. So this particular film is one that I have had my eyeball on for a while. And also, uh, came in that fancy little, uh, again, uh, protective thingy-majig. Let's pull it on out. Now it's funny as this looks very familiar, like it looks very much like a, a Witchboard movie that came out a while ago. Uh, this is, I believe, done by uh, Kevin Tenney, who, uh, you know, did Night of the Demons. So, and uh, Linnea Quigley is also in this film. So this is uh, Witch Trap right here. Oh, let me uh, show you the front. And again, I love these slip covers. They have that crazy, the eyes just kind of pop. Let me look at that right there. So uh, let me let me tell you all really quick here. Witch Trap. Uh, for years, 
The Lauder House has been plagued by strange and violent occurrences. Unexplained deaths and seemingly supernatural activities have scared away all prospective tenants and buyers, but now its owners have decided to turn the old mansion into a bed and breakfast. Interesting. Uh, follow a team of paranormal experts as they attempt to remove the demonic forces uh, and cleanse the property of all evil. Through the use of a special device designed to lure in and trap evil spirits. That sounds like Ghostbusters. Okay. Um, yeah. But as soon as they arrive, the violence begins again as members of the team begin to meet increasingly bloody fates. So that is the uh, little premise around witch trap right there. So I am excited to watch this one uh, the most out of these ones. Um, just because, again, I am a pretty big fan of Night of the Demons, so I am a stoked about that. So uh, that's really it. Thanks for watching my uh, little haul of uh, eBay purchases. I'm sure uh, everyone that's watching. Let me know what uh, thing you've bought off eBay recently that's been something you've been pining after for a while. This one in particular has definitely been one that I have been pining after. Um, now my other two that I am definitely trying to get my hands on, I think it's uh, the Demon Wind uh, film. And uh, I don't know why, but I'm, I'm really wanting that Evil Town film for some odd reason, even though it's crazy expensive now. Um, I am glad that I did buy Mausoleum a while back because that is a very expensive film now as well, and I got it at a really good price. So that's it uh, for my little Vinegar Syndrome eBay haul video. Thanks for watching, guys, and remember to subscribe to my channel. And if you are subscribed, 